to learn about Logan at the record label, but I'm really excited about it. I can see that. I already have a million ideas. I think this is going to be a great move for me, but you don't seem so convinced. Are you worried that I'm not going to be able to do it? Absolutely not. Bite your tongue. My daughter can do anything she puts her mind to. Well, I appreciate the vote of confidence, but I think both of us are getting ahead of ourselves. What do you mean? Well, I haven't even told Blaze the idea yet. And if she doesn't take this leap of faith with me, then the whole record label idea is dead in the water. Oh, that's not going to happen. No, this is a great opportunity for Blaze. I mean, what artist would turn down this deal, especially one who's trying to make a comeback after being dropped by her own record label? Yeah, I hope you're right. Blaze really has been through a lot lately. And this would not only help rebuild her career, but it would take her career to the next level. You know I'm always rooting for you, honey. Thanks, Mom. That being said, I I do have some questions about Sonny's involvement. Well, that's the crazy part. Other than putting up the money, I don't think Sonny's going to be involved at all. I'm going to be the one making all the decisions. It's perfect, right? I'm so sorry. I didn't know that y'all were. John is just here using the shower. The place he's staying has terrible water pressure, and he needs to be all, all uh, ship shape important FBI business. <laughs> of course, showers are important. Well, I'm just gonna go to work and then I'll just I'll see you at the gallery. Yeah, I'll be there soon. Okay, bye. 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 Mm -hmm. You know, a little discretion on your part would have gone a long way. So a heads up, you had a guest. I didn't realize I had to clear my visitors with you. Well, you don't, but if you didn't want us to get caught together, you should have told me somebody was here. <laughs> I didn't anticipate you parading naked through my suite like your own place. Well, you didn't have any complaints about my state of undress last night. Keywords being last night. Well, we had fun, yeah, but you can't, you can't stay here. I'm, I'm headed into a custody battle with Sunny, and if my visitor had been anybody other than treating you, being here would have made me look very, very bad. Don't worry about it. You're not going to have to testify against me. Really? Yeah, this is going to be over before, you know, the court date. I hope so. Okay, have a seat, darling. And just relax. And tell me what else is going on. Oh, well, uh, oh. I have this... Oh, father-daughter. So, Sonny, uh, the court has ruled against your attempt to block Ava's dissertation with Avery. She will be spending the weekend with the kid. Here you go. We will see. Okay, this is not up for negotiations. Court has spoken. And when I get through with you, the only way you're going to send that kid is through a pair of binoculars. He's hurting at me. Dad, stop. He's what? trying to rally you up. It's not worth it. Oh, look, she's trying to keep the peace. Get out of here. Go, go, go. So, I'm going to see you tomorrow at 10 a.m. On the news. Talking about people? Let's see, you don't have an appointment. You haven't read that subpoena very well, have you? Do you think it's possible that you misinterpreted what Christina said in that interview? Okay, that sounds like you've already talked to Christina about this. Is that why you wanted to meet up? No, absolutely not. I, I, I told you I wanted to meet up with you because I haven't seen you in a really long time. And no, I have not talked to Christina, but... I don't know, maybe she didn't mean to imply that the baby was hers in places. Okay, but see, you know exactly what I mean. Obviously, you interpreted what Christina said the same way I did. Well, I mean, she could have been clearer. By saying that there were some things she wanted to keep private, she implied that she and Blaze are the ones who are about to become happy new parents. I mean, that's what everybody on social media thinks. Oh, no, 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 you gotta stop doing that. Don't, don't look at social media, so stop scrolling, yes. okay? You're right about that. But I don't know, even staying off social media, it's not going to change what Christina said or what she definitely did not say. She could have avoided all this confusion so easily by just explaining that the baby is not hers. Okay, well, did you talk to Christina about that? Yes, of course. Christy says that she was just trying to protect me and TJ's privacy. Well, that sounds plausible. Do you believe her? I don't know. 